so we are in Tatooine, Tunisia, and we are going hunting for food. Welcome to Tatooine. This is the Luage station. Now we have to make our way to our hotel. That was probably one of the more difficult Luage journeys we've made. This guy drove insane. And I got some video of it. We'll put that into our video as we cut it all together. Catherine got a little car sick. How you feeling? And uh, she, she had to go to sleep. I started getting a little car sick. Um, but we made it. And probably record time. That's probably the fastest trip from Hamsuk to Tatooine in the history of the world. We got a taxi. We're headed to the hotel. And it's five dinar from the Luaj station to the city center, which is about a dollar seventy ish. So it's not bad for a one way ride. When we come back to the Luage, which you saw in the other part of the video, we have to go to Gabus and then to Tozer. That's going to be a long day. So we'll be here in Tatooine for two days and then we leave. It's just a short trip. Um, and we'll see what we can see in a day, but I don't know if we'll be able to see everything. Mainly, I just want to see some of the Star Wars movie set stuff, if we can see that here. And then maybe just grab a little bit of time down in the Sahara. But we'll just have to see. Also, I just don't want to rush things and just do a little bit at a time. But anyway, uh, Tati, Tatooine, Tunisia. There's the kiddos. All of our bags are in the back. Uh, I don't know. What is the, the word up there? Is it Tatooine? This is Tatooine in Arabic. They yeah, have, we will come to Tatooine. Welcome to Tatooine. Okay, so the they got one. I'll show you guys here in the video, but. They've got some Arabic writing on the hillside that says, Welcome to Tatooine. That's very cool. Hello. Bonjour. Okay, so our hotel should be right here. Right here. This one here. Let me go in first. Bonjour. We have a reservation. Yes. Perfect. This is our room. Okay, so this is our hostel. Okay, there is the sign that says, Welcome to Tatooine. You can hear the call to prayer. Looks like there's other travelers here. No, straight. Right here, let's go this way. So we're looking for fricassees, Malawis. Yeah, let's go here. That looks perfect. What do you want? Look, they have brick. You have Malawi fricassee. We have fricassee. Brick. That's it. You want to? Okay. Okay. We'll try one. Okay, one. And brick. Yes. We'll try it, and we'll just keep walking down. We'll look for. Yeah. Brick. No, just one. Just one. How much? How much is it? And did not save some. I see. No. That's all I have. Yeah, no, no malim. How's it taste? Good? What's the matter? Have a bite. No, I don't. have a bite because that way it has to be back That's good. You want one? Huh? You don't want another one? I want another one. One more for me. Mm -hmm. This 
enough? One dinar. One dinar? Yeah. All I have are those. Here. Thank you. Still having a crown. I'm not really sure how much I just paid for those. I think they were one dinar or something, but I think you overcharged me and didn't give me my change back. That's okay. Let's go find more food. That, ca Captain, while you were sleeping today, guess what we saw on the highway? A herd of camels, like a hundred of them. Here, give me a bite. No cotton candy. That's right. Alright, Brick. Hiya, come here. Brickia. What is Brickia? Oh no, I don't have. I don't smoke. But thank you. Okay, I'm sorry. Bye bye. I want a cigarette, but I don't smoke. Here. Look, fricassees. Do you want a fricassee? Huh? Is that enough? You want fries? Fries. Okay. Let's see. Let's see if they're serving food. No, eat. I'm gonna get me a fricassee and some french fries. I love Canadian food. You do? What are you eating? A Greek. A what? A Greek. Mexican food and Tunisian food. And Chinese food. Have you had Chinese food yet? In China? Restaurants Huh? I haven't had them in China. Okay, we haven't had, had Chinese food. But I have eaten them at restaurants. That's more like American food, junk food than it is Chinese food. But, but check this out. This is something we've been looking for. We saw it one time in in Seuss, and now we have here. Stand right here. That's an actual camel's head for sale at a butcher. That's pretty wild. I don't know if that what they make with it, but it's uh, Berber's Berber. Yeah, Berber's eat. I think Berbers eat camel, Bedouins eat horse, and Arabs eat goat. That's... Oh, there's a camel's hoof. I guess they make... They're probably making soup or something with that. I love the small spice. I know, the spice markets are pretty neat. Look at all these chilies. These are what I think they probably make harissa with, or these things. Let's see what's over here. Well, there, at least they have some banks here, so if we need to pull some cash, we can. There's a cafe. Got some oranges. see what this was so you have a looks like a Bedouin on a horse I was hoping that said Tatooine okay so you can see we just kind of walked around the central district here in Tatooine looking for a place to grab some food we did find a place that has breeks but we don't really want to just eat those all day every day um, I was wanting to get a fricassee we're gonna walk back down here again because 
Maybe there were some other restaurants where you just didn't stop and check. Again, I don't know what they're charging us, if it's the good price or not. So we're we're going to be here tonight, tomorrow, but I think we're going to do the day trip if, if it's not too expensive. If it's too ridiculous, then Star Wars, you're just going to have to wait till we're millionaires. But anyway, so you see it's kind of difficult to kind of find your way. Well, and just trying to find, just trying to find a place to grab some food it proves to be difficult in some, some cities. Other cities, it's very easy. Like in Seuss, it was very easy. Here, so we went that way. If we went that way, that, maybe we can go down here again. Anyway. I don't know. We're kind of kind of striking out and it gets really discouraging. <laughs> what do you say? All right, here we go. This is our first meal. This is our first meal in Tatooine, Tunisia. This is a Lebanese restaurant. We came in, we were the only ones in here, and as you can see, it's gotten very busy. One thing about Tunisia is when we go into the restaurant, we will go in, there'll be no crowds. We walk in, when, 30 seconds later, there's a whole bunch of people just coming in. Because well, we always look for the empty restaurants. Yeah. We're in Tatooine, Tunisia. <laughs> Tatooine, like the planet Luke Skywalker is from in Star Wars. That's why we are here, actually. Today we're going to do a day trip to this little town north of here, about 20 kilometers, called Sar Hadada. That is where they filmed part of the movie The Phantom Menace, Phantom Menace whenever Anakin Skywalker was a young boy. And when Qui-Gon Jinn and Obi-Wan Kenobi found him, the town is where they did a lot of the scenes. So we're gonna go there today, get our Star Wars fix. So we are beginning our day trip to go to Moss. We gotta watch the hang the clothes. They hang the clothes real low and you bang their clothes and knock them off their hangers. Um, anyway, we're beginning our day trip to Sar Hadada. Go to the right. Hey, this way. I have to kind of like weave our way through. It's, it's just like any other city we've been in in Tunisia. It's a little a little wild trying to walk around. So we're going to Sar Hadada. We've got to catch a luage because the bus leaves at 8 o'clock in the morning. And last night was a little bit of a long night because our, hot, our room in our hostel is right on the window on the street. And there was a lot of street noise last night. We're not used to that. So we didn't get a lot of sleep. So we slept in just a little bit this morning. We had breakfast at the hostel. And now we're on our way to catch the luage. Okay, so we found our luage. You can see this one has the blue stripe, not the yellow. 6,000 uh, malim or 6 dinar uh, for each of us. So about 18 dinar. See the kids in the back? I'm going to ride in the front on this one because I want to shoot some video as we're driving through the desert. Alright, here's the view from the co-pilot seat. So I think we're full, so they always fill up before we leave. And then we're going on our way to Sar Hadada.
No, this is Gomares and the children are still in the back. Oh, we're the last ones. Okay, Zar Hadada, next stop. We got our own private driver now. Yeah, yeah, uh, just for a visit. Yeah, yeah I just want to yeah. see the hotel. Okay, so here is the scenes that they shot this, here this in this. this so Qui Gon Jinn and yes. Anakin's mother. Yes. There's Anakin Skywalker before he became a Jedi. And there is Ezekiel playing Call of Duty. <laughs> Okay, so we're here at Zar Hadada. This is the scene where Anakin and his mother lived. This is where they lived in this area. Whoa. So this is like a cafe. These were still for storage, I think. I think that's what, that's what I've read about them. Let me see how big this one is. Go. Okay, we're here at Zar Hadada. You can see all the ruins. I think these are called Zars. I, I have to do a little bit of research on this because I wasn't really prepared for this. I thought we were going to see a movie set or something. I thought, okay, so my whole thing of wanting to see Star Wars in Tunisia is I want to go to the set town of Mos Espa. We've been having trouble locating where that's at, but I think someone told us today that it's in Tozer. That's where we're going tomorrow, and that's one of the reasons why we're going to Tozer. So this was kind of an unexpected blessing in spite of all the challenges that we were having to overcome this morning and we'll work through them just step by step by step but anyway how epic is that man that is so cool and i think those were used for storage like maybe grain storage or something and i think there are places that they go up another level but i don't know if that's here in this area okay we made it back to tatooine it's didn't take as long as I thought it would. We didn't walk very far, actually. We were able to get a taxi. The taxi was uh, 25 dinar to come from the town we were in to here, which is turns out it's like $8 for the taxi ride, which, yeah, it was probably $2 more than the Luage, but we didn't have to wait. We didn't have to wait. It brought us right to the center by where our hotel is. And we and it came fast, and we ended, didn't have to ride in the back seat of a luage, or you know. But the main thing was is that it saved our time. Check out this graffiti over here. This is some amazing stuff, and I think there's like some more graffiti here in Tatooine. Check that out. Isn't that amazing? And there's a girl here. It's beautiful. I love graffiti. Um, check out this old truck. That. They got some old vehicles here. Okay, so there's the map there of the area. We were just up at Hadada and we at Gomrasen is where we caught the taxi back to Tatooine. And then here is the Berber village. 
Okay, so we're in this little town just south of Tatooine called Benny Borka. This is a, a Berber community. We were told to come out here by our, our hostel host, and I think we're trying to get up there on top of that, up there. Let's see, I can't see. We got, we got somebody here trying to help us because they don't think we should walk up there. It's a long distance, yes, very far. Um, but there's no taxis. Taxi here? No taxi. No. No taxi. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so we didn't get all the information that we needed. It's a long it's distance. A yes, it's a long distance, but how do you go? So she, they're telling us that we need a car to get up there, and we just got dropped off here on the highway by the Luai. So, I don't know. I think they're warning us not to go. Okay, thank you so much. Okay, bye-bye. I think they're kind of warning us not to go. It's very far, but they don't know how much we hike and how far we hike. But it's just kind of late in the day. But there's Benny Borka, and maybe that's as close as we're going to get to it. Because if we got to start walking back towards Tatooine, it's maybe five kilometers or something. I'm almost tempted to, to try it, but it's already 4 o'clock in the afternoon. So I think we'll just head back to Tatooine, and maybe next trip we'll do this. Because we've really got to have a car. Okay, so we started walking back to Tatooine because everybody told us not to go up the, the mountain walking. Everybody said we needed a car. At least that's what we were kind of getting from the translation. So we were walking and we flagged down a ride. So I guess it's the children's first official hitchhiking success story in Tunisia. So the we just wanted to make it. is a helicopter. Yeah, we just haven't ridden anywhere in a helicopter as a family yet. So maybe we'll get to do that. Anyway, what a day, man. This day has been full of challenges and unexpected surprises, and we got to do some cool stuff, too. So we're just going to head back to the hostel. i got to pack up everything and get ready, and I've still I've got a raging headache because I haven't eaten anything today. Anyway, we leave tomorrow. Headed back north.